No, he's doing it while they're there. Nafany point blank with the Glock into automatic. Little bit of breeze left over here. Seven health. He'll be burned back and Axile's on the board early. We'll get the CT's boost on smoke. No impact off that. Shiro holds flank and Cloud9 content with what's happened. Smoke's down on the cross. Walk that bad boy right into the site. And when Inters pops up, Cirque's a dead man walking. Yeah, yeah. they just had him everywhere right there. Hex tucked behind boxes. Naf and he's gonna inch his way inwards. And Cirk gets another kill in. Hex is able to dive back into the site. They've got fire at the feet of multiple players. Damage all over and EG just crunch. They throw Cirk into the tunnels. Axile tries to bring it back, but it's just the one kill. Point blank crossfire, better hold him back. It's all the Cloud9 coming in. Ooh, two off Hex, SMG tucks back onto car. He's hoping Automatic can maybe help by shooting the M4 through the doorway, but now nafany has got the better gun, the better spot, and the better footing inside this bomb site. And the smoke lands inside of Car just in case there's someone there. Gives him some time to go for this. Flash comes over. Nafany holds off the first one, but Automatic trades in. And now they're going to try to reroute back through window. We've got Cirque posted on the tunnel peak. Axile can not step out. Shiro tucked behind box, sees both CTs. Time's critical, and the Tech-9 comes out. He's getting rushed down, point blank. Nicely oh. dodged. Another jump, and Ooh. Shiro snaps it up. Naphany, almost got a little bit of breeze. Oh, oh, there's a little bit of breeze. And Shiro, he may be looking the wrong way. Hobbit, he'll get it back with two kills, but he just let Shiro die. <laughs> Straight up, let that man die. Moves forward into the Scout of Automatic, who dives down into the site. And Inters is just oh. gonna run him down up close and personal. Sees the second. Woo. Inters has also been keeping things sharp. So it's not just Axile that's coming back into form. We saw some really good events out of Inters in the recent months. Yeah. And that was way above his average. EG had tried this a couple of times. Uh oh. Breeze in the corner. Yeah, Napani's gonna fall to that. Excellent little two-piece here from Breeze, and Cirque's not going to let the pressure off. The little that remains of Cloud9. And honestly, Automatic, Hex, and Breeze all coming together to put up some numbers. It's kneeling with that last piece, so they'll trail by five. If a good T-side is in EG's back pocket, then maybe they bring this one back. Oof. Damn it. That'll leave a mark. Shiro. Hit in the head by utility, but uh, it doesn't hurt as much as that bullet sure did. Cirque will find the 5v4. We've got Inter and Axile wounded already. Not going to stop them, seemingly, from shutting down the top of ramp. Axile oh. hits another. And we've got Hobbit on the flank. Oh. Taps automatic. Oh. Nafany's in. Thing is, he's peeking into three Ts. The flash is real good. And Hobbit's going to bring Breeze down with him. Cirque able to get the trade frag, but it's man advantage. Axile fighting automatic down long, and Bomb stalls out towards middle. It's Nafany wasting no moment, instantly attacking them from the back. He draws them, though, as uh, he doesn't get the kill. It will go well towards long, and with seven seconds on the clock, Shiro's going to stuff Cirque. Hexed up oh next, boy. he's dead. Cirque? Yes. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Here we come off of the catwalk. EG going to try to push their way in at the 35 second mark. Shiro gets blinded. Not going to stop him. We got a T getting closer, but Nafany's caught Hex and Hobbit stuffs the first one. Neelan can bring this back. He's having a bit of a slow game. And unfortunately, with all that pressure from Util, he just can't move it forward. Shiro's swapping guns. Neelan's going to try to again move in, but. Awkward once the smoke goes down, and Inters will clean that one up with absolute ease. It's Axile's chance now. Saw the gun barrel, gets the bomb dropped in the distance, and Cirque, well, it's nothing but desperation. He's going to try to cross, and he doesn't even have the bomb, so dead man walking. Cloud9 with a world-class domination of evil geniuses here on Dust2. This may have been a team that was sent down to the 0-2 group, but after dispatching Imperial yesterday, it seems like EG are quick work. They got spotted by Nafany's jump up, so now this player's on site, high alert. Axile waits for the flash, pops out, gets hit by the second one, but so does EG. And now Axile's pinned in, stops the bomb, Cirque crosses over, Nafany's dead, and Neelan's gonna bust through. Man advantage EG. As they
they clear out those corners. Inters gets instant dink. Cirque's tearing him up in this pistol. But we've got Shiro left. He sees automatic in the back, and it's Cirque with three in the pistol round for Evil Genius's T side kickoff. Let's just not let that happen again. Or, ow. I mean, ew. Two players walk out through monster smoke. That could not have been any easier for Inters. Yeah. I'll look to try to make a round of it. Where would they go? Then, long player serves up the distraction for Axile to swing. Breeze's Deke finds its mark. Oh, oh! Times two. But time? Oh, just enough. Breeze is worried about Bank, but he needs to focus in. Oh. Hobbit's going to finish that. They've lost track of Cirque. He slides out and ties out to Hobbit, who just comes through with the two critical kills. But, man, EG have left this down to the wire. Breeze... He did crack open this site last time, but Cirque's not posted, and Naphany's got himself another. Cirque will finally get a trade back the way of EG. Eight seconds, desperate, and no HP left over. They get hard stuffed on the front of that one by Cloud9's IGL. Now into a super high alert. Second flash oh, comes second out. second flash. That one's killer, but Cirque actually never got blinded by it and peeks out to support. They take a player off site. We've got everything from Cloud9 that's left inside B. Neelan alleviates a little pressure by dropping Hobbit. Nafany and Shiro gonna have to do it all with four players ahead of them. And Cirque just expecting that walk up. Shiro dives around the corner, but EG just easily come into this B bomb site. And Axile's trying to focus in on bathrooms. We'll find Breeze for free. Good amount of damage there versus Nealon. Nafany sits back, waits, lines them up, takes down one, and great cover by Cirque. Back-to-back -back rounds, he hits hard. Shiro connects, hexed up next. Nine HP, bomb denied as Hobbit comes through smoke. And it's gonna leave Nafany entirely on his own. He's got teammates running up, trying to help. What can Nafany do while he's here alone? Nealon goes down with his back turned. Axile shows up and enters Flash. It oh. is perfection. Automatic stuck in the bathrooms, and as EG scramble, they get just absolutely splattered. It's desperate, but they all have been. Essentially, EG just pressing into a site with mere seconds to spare. Shiro's 5-7, good. Nafany in from the corner with one. We've got another player there. It's constantly Hobbit, who just throws himself into the mix the moment EG look like they have a damn chance, and then he slides smoothly wide to give Cloud9 their 10th. Yeah. You know, Hobbit, I think, did his job in order to just keep C9 afloat, and that did give time for Axile to crank it up a notch. But it's just the one from Axile here in round 15, so yes, there is a chance until Shiro shows up. Hexed, hit by that, sitting on 59. Plenty more time than usual from EG as they do get footing on the bomb site. Shiro's gonna get caught off, but he's still standing. What? Somehow still alive with two HP. Automatic's gonna have to come in for the 1v4, and down he goes as well. It's 11 on the defense from Cloud9, a mere six rounds away. I mean, five. The form of Cloud9 right now is just so undeniable. Here comes the commitment. Off the back of the utility, Hobbit insta pop breeze. Oh, Nafany wow. saves Axile as him and Hex were so close. Cirque gets something going, but Inters tears through two. Jesus. And with a pistol round win. Now, this might be an interesting spot for Hex to get to, because they, could they expect him to be up here? Ah, Axile swings, though. Shooting sharp. Nice drive-by by Hobbit, but he's blind. <laughs> and he regains vision just in the nick of time. Automatic throws himself through the fire. He's going to shoot Hobbit in the back. Shiro answers, and we've got a 1v1, folks, to close out 15 to Cloud9. And we talk about Shiro and his clutch. Cirque. Oh, you read this correctly. Walks he, out. You know Cirque is walking out, but can he get to the right spot? Oh, just gets around, Ooh. and Cirque hits the shot, just like he did up towards that A site. Sketchy situation there. Uh -oh. Automatic, did he not get spotted? I don't know. Hobbit. Flash is Ooh. great. Perfect from Cirque. This time, no hesitation. Mm -hmm. Straight at the action. Automatic comes in big with two kills and falls away as well. There's the flashes that pop perfectly. Axile pressing in. Nafany's got the only other kill so far for Cloud9. And Breeze hangs on to the wood wall. He's waiting. Flashman for Axile. Oh, oh Neil, it gets wrecked in the backdrop. Breeze comes in and okay. Automatic once again offering some help here. So, oh, but Inter is now up the left side. Almost draws Cirque too far into Ooh. the open, but he gets himself all three. 
From inside that bomb site, you said it's Cirque's turn. Hobbit. Hobbit knows he got by. Easy pick up onto Cirque. Now the long players can just sprint, run, forward, go. And all they have to do is topple Neelan. He's behind the truck. Insta headshot onto Hobbit. That's going to help. But Ooh. Naphany's got the answer back. And the T side, they've got no smokes, no incendiaries. Can't keep EG back. This retake's coming, and they can't stop it unless they find the frags. Shiro finding Breeze on the cross to the truck. Little bit of cover. All he's got. And the fire now burns him perfectly into the open. Oh. How? With four health left. He gets the better of the first, and it's hexed up into the clutch. First player down. Bombs ticking fast. Smoke destined for the defuse, but he gets caught by Axile. Not expecting it, and Inters is also running away. The mid play is going to serve up a distraction. Now, automatic spot is known. Hobbit could end up being the key piece, and Shiro doesn't get anything from that. It's damage in from Hobbit. Automatic. Oh! oh! Executed through the box. Next one's low, and Hobbit, just one more kill versus Cirque point blank. C9 looking to continue this run from the 0-2, Woo! and Hobbit's nailed them all. EG with a valiant effort to run that one back, but it's a flat T side that comes back to haunt them. And Cloud9, not just Shiro, but Cloud9 will succeed tonight.